live and it takes a little while to oh, catch right. up. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. And That's all good, thanks. Hi guys, this is Charles. I'm one of the surgeons of South Paws. Still. Um, so we've got this cat here that we're doing the electric chemotherapy on for uh, multiple squamous cell carcinomas. So the first one I'm going to treat is the one on the back of the ear here. And so I just put the needle probe in. Hopefully I've shocked myself. Okay, and we have to treat at 90 degree angles um, because the cells have to be oriented within 90 degrees. So you can see the twitch that we get. And I'm going to treat with concentric circles around the area. And by treating in concentric circles, what it does is it causes vasoconstriction, which tends to lock the bleomycin in for a longer period of time. I'll get that little twitch each time. Um, and Ali, the next time I treat, just um, point it at the screen there so you can see the actual pulses. So I go all the way around at this first angle and then I'll go back through we can come back over to the cat now. At 90 degree orthogonal. So now I'm going to do the 90 degree orthogonal. And the electric chemotherapy machine, considering what it's capable of doing, is not outrageously expensive. It's probably about uh, 7,000, 8,000 euros. And we've done several hundred treatments in cats. Um, and particularly with squamous cell carcinoma, we've had really great success. All right, so that's this area treated. I'll do another little one right there. You can read the questions out to me if you like. Uh, oh, um, fermented. How does this work? Um, so the way that it works is that it causes, so the electric shock causes the cells to temporarily open up um, and to allow the chemo in, otherwise the chemotherapy is completely inert. And it's so nice because we can treat a very large area very, very quickly and very, very effectively with almost no side effects. So it's hard to, it's almost too good to be true.
Just make sure there's nothing natural uh, lesions on the. There's a bit of solar keratosis. We'll just keep an eye on those. Uh, yeah. Yes, please. So the treatment costs the pet owner about two thousand dollars, which is a fraction of the cost that it would be for surgery or radiation therapy. Just make sure there are no other lesions that I've missed. He's the Guamison Gibbon Eagle Grass Lake. The Bleomycin is given intravenously, and I think it's 15 international units per meter squared. So your average cat gets about 3 milliliters intravenously when it's diluted one to, uh, uh, in 10 mils. So I think that's pretty much it. So we'll just keep an eye on this. And if we need to, we can repeat it in a month. Um, but usually we don't have to. Usually they just completely regress. I might just treat a little bit more in there because that's the big nasty one. Um, and that's pretty much it. So thanks a lot for watching. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe to our channel. Make sure you turn on notifications. And if you want to see a bunch of behind the scenes and clinical short videos and things like that, look at our YouTube membership.